Uh, this is a tough week. Chargers in a very short week. They got a lot of guys dinged up. Very short practice week. Get on the plane to go to Kansas City on Friday. Not an easy trip. Not an easy venue. Let's flip back for a minute and look. Justin Herbert versus Dak Prescott. I mean, I guess to a degree it was a really ugly game, John. But I'll tell you the defenses. They just had their way. And the pressure those two quarterbacks were under was phenomenal. And they stood in there and made plays. They got chased out of the pocket. They moved the pocket. They made plays on the run. They ran with the football, too. Justin Herbert played pretty competitively, considering he was under siege the whole night. The Chargers chased Prescott all over the place. And that looked like vintage Dak Prescott from very early in his career, where he would move the pocket and run. It moved the pocket and throw on the run, and he was unbelievably accurate. He had a ton of plays downfield in that game. Uh, I just, I just thought it was a, a tremendous game in terms of strategy. And I'm coming to get your quarterback, and how's the quarterback going to handle it? Justin Herbert couldn't match everything that Dak Prescott did. Cowboys wide receivers made a bunch of plays. Tony Pollard, the running back, catch and run, had over 110 all-purpose yards. Uh, the pass rush on both, both sides of the line of scrimmage was really, really fierce. Now, I will tell you, the quarterback's taken an enormous amount of heat right now, and I, I think it's kind of unfair. Um, Dak, uh, Justin Herbert, you know, he's, he's got some challenges here because they don't have a heavy-duty running game. I think the offensive line has been kind of leaky to the point of almost being awful this season. You know, in that game on Monday, he took a sack, 12 pressures, seven hits. I thought the line let him down. The offensive line had seven penalties in the game. And, of course, the Charger defense, there were third down personal foul penalties. It kept Dallas drives alive, 20 penalties in the game. Uh, the this, this statistics are staggering. So we are five games into the Charger season. They have given up 75 plays of plus 10. That's 75 <laughs> first downs. They have given up 25 plays of plus 20, and wow. they've given up five plays of plus 50. Jeez. Really? So your reaction, Dak versus Justin, I thought it was entertaining. I thought it was frantic, and Prescott made a few more plays than Justin did. Well, yeah, I was flipping back and forth between this game and the MLB playoffs. But it, it got interesting at the end. And in the fourth quarter, Dallas goes down and drives and scores. And the Chargers get the ball back, you know, with what it was about a minute or two minutes left. And sure enough, the, the, he, Justin Herbert, he's under a lot of pressure, but he threw an interception there at the end. And it was just typical Chargers. I mean, just blowing it at the end, um, you know, and, and blowing it at the end at home. So, God, I mean, that's, I mean, how long is Brandon Staley going to stick around as head coach? He's under siege. There's an awful lot of criticism of Justin Herbert. I, I think the least of the problems with the Chargers is the quarterback. I got a ton of problems atop that scale.